Hi, my name is Lauren Ramsos, and for my motion analysis project, I decided to focus on tracks, specifically on track starts. The athlete that I worked with was Juju Hancock. She runs track, and the events she runs are mainly sprints, such as the 100, 200, and 400. Here are a few pictures that model correct form in the three basic positions of a track start. In first position, you should have your head down, looking at the line with your dominant foot forward and your fingers right before the line. The second position, you should have your hips raised and you should be balancing just above the line, leaning forward, but not so much that you are tipping over, which would lead to a disqualification. And your legs should not be fully extended. The third position is the position when you actually start running. You should have your arms pumping forward with your head still looking down and pushing out with your leading leg. Here is an excellent sample of what it should look like. View of Powell's explosive start. Um, as you can see, his arms are pushing forward and fully extended, and in the other picture, you can see how his leg is also fully extended, pushing off with his dominant leg. Um, the first thing I had Juju do was send me a video of her running and track start so I could see what her form looked like in order to implement a program to correct her form and exercises to make her push off. Um, stronger. Um, after watching the video, the corrections that need to be made were her first and second position, her push off, and her overall form. Um, I next came up with a daily workout and warm-up to improve her form. Her whole circuit was a total of five days. Every day I had her start off with a warm-up with either two laps on the track or running at home. I then had her do both isotonic and isometric exercises and I let her choose what she wanted to do. After she finished stretching, she would work on her starting drills. Her first starting, starting drill was a standing reaction drill. Her second was a med ball triple extension drill, and her third was her wall drills. I would have her repeat the drills two times in sets of three. After she finished with her starting form drills, I would have her do a workout to strengthen muscles in order for a stronger push off. Some of the exercises include Russian twists, planks, split squats, bench glute raises, push ups, bicycles, lying leg raises, lateral lunges, and tricep dips. Here is an example of her first form exercise, the standing reaction drill. Good. Um, this exercise really helps your elbow, draw, elbow drive and it really targets your arms to help them drive you forward getting out of the blocks. Her second form exercise targets explosiveness from the legs, which crosses over to her pushing out of the start. And her third form exercise was the wall drill. Um, this drill really targets, targeted her back leg, um, helping it to explode and push out of the blocks. And finally, here are her results. Um, as you can see, she begins in the first position 
with her head down and her dominant foot forward. And in her second position, she is balanced above the line and her push off is much more explosive coming out. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you have any questions or comments.